A record setting couple of days for fall Chinook salmon migrating to the fish ladder at Bonneville Dam. On Monday alone, more than 67,000 navigated the passage. That's the most Chinook a single day since the dam was built 70 years ago. Wow, about one and a half million fall Chinook salmon are expected this season, which would also be a record. Jeb Becker is here. He's in the newsroom with the facts on why these record numbers are just rolling in now. Well, and you know, 2013 was a record year also, so we are trending upward, and it's not a random occurrence either. Some of you might have even helped if you're an electric rate payer or federal taxpayer. Last week was the big kickoff where we started to see the, the fish passage numbers start to climb, and hopefully in the next uh, 14 days or so, we're going to see that record met and exceeded. Biologist Bernard Klatt tells me a lot of time, effort, and hard work is finally paying off. Sunday, a new single day record of just over 67,000 salmon climbed the fish ladders at Bonneville Dam. Then Monday, almost 500 more than that. I think we spent a lot of time and money over the past three decades researching fish passage and we finally nailed it. And I think you're seeing uh, a response. We've had some of the best returns uh, for uh, many species of fish uh, since these dams have been built. The Bonneville Power Administration using ratepayer money and the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers with federal funds. We finally figured it out and we have it dialed in now. And a host of other state, local, and tribal groups have been working to perfect fish passage for decades. Last year, that resulted in the biggest fall Chinook run ever, around 1.3 million fish. This is a success story uh, for the Northwest and the people of the Northwest. Success like never before. More fish-friendly turbines, improved habitat and hatchery reform, and improved surface passage all helped create this historic run, one that started decades ago when the push to become fish-friendly began. Out of uh, uh, 30 fish uh, that pass through the dams, you might have one that, uh, that gets uh, hung up somewhere in the, in the process. So you know, we're looking at, uh, at pretty fish-friendly uh, facilities. So close to a half million have passed the dam since the run began, 300,000 alone since this time last week. And in case you're wondering, yes, all that fish does help bring prices down at the market. But the big question is, will it continue? We'll check back from time to time and we'll let you know. Jeff?